I just remember going up here and regretting it. It was really cold. And I thought I could handle it, like when you first get in, like you can't breathe. Do not panic because you have one minute to get your breathing under control. You have 10 minutes of meaningful movement. And you have one hour before you become unconscious due to hypothermia. We're going to talk about this 1-10-1 principle that we developed. It goes like this. The first thing is focus on surviving the first minute by just getting control of your breathing. Don't panic. That breathing problem will pass. You have time then to consider your actions. You have 10 minutes of meaningful movement for self-rescue. And once you start feeling weaker, in a cold incapacitation scenario, you're never going to get any better. And you have one hour before you become unconscious due to hypothermia. Only if you have a life jacket on, because there's no way without a life jacket that you can keep your head above water long enough, okay? So a life jacket really increases your chance of survival, as we all know. But you have one simple principle, one minute to get your breathing under control, 10 minutes of meaningful movement, one hour before you become unconscious due to hypothermia, one minute, 10 minutes, one hour, and if you can just remember that, that's your cue to remember a whole textbook of cold physiology. Always wear your life jacket. You need to leave it up to the life jacket to keep you afloat.